Now, the history of the character of Krampus goes back to the Alpine regions of Austria, Germany, Switzerland, and parts of Slovenia in Italy. In the pre-Christian period of these Alpine regions, there was a deity or a goddess named Frau Pershta. She would either appear as a woman dressed in white that would give gifts like a silver coin on the solstice or would appear as an old hag witch that would cause harm to people that weren't in the Christmas spirit. The church banned the Persian Louth and did not want people following this specific tradition anymore. So in order to work around this, the people in these Alpine regions created a new type of holiday figure. Krampus was nearly identical to the Persian that would ward off evil spirits and he would also be accompanied by a Saint Nick. The entire folklore of Krampus and the Christmas traditions that it encompasses can more or less be summed up as just trying to keep the spirit alive. Here we are live at the Krampus walk. <laughs> live from the 2021 Krampus Run. At UPMC, we're pioneering new ways to treat cancer, and we're working to prevent it. We're advancing new technology to look more closely at disease and helping you breathe easier. We perform the world's first heart liver transplant, and we're experts at keeping your heart beating strong. We're a global team of more than 90,000, advancing care everywhere and delivering it closer to you. UPMC, life-changing medicine.